I have been told that I can't use a CO2 argon mix as a shielding gas when I'm TIG welding aluminum, and I have no idea why. So I'm going to put it to the test. Here we go. First thing I'm going to do is clean the aluminum with some acetone. All right, now I'm going to set my welder to AC, flick it on. We'll see what it's set to, 122 amps. That's certainly enough for right now. All right, now let's turn on the gas. All right, we're going to start with argon, so I have a baseline. Got plenty of it. All right, so I just kind of threw down a weld on this flat piece of aluminum, and it looks like a weld, nothing fancy. I sort of lifted a little too soon on the end and made a mess. I realize I'm not a professional welder. All right, so let's try the CO2 argon mix next. All right, now I've got my CO2 argon mix hooked, in, hooked into the TIG welder. I'm gonna turn it on. And now let's weld some stuff. All right. That doesn't work. Okay, so right off the bat, if you try and weld with the CO2 hooked up, mixed with the argon, that does not work at all. Although the CO2 is definitely coming out of here, it just plain does not work. So I guess that's why you always use argon instead of CO2 when you're welding aluminum. Now we know.